My name is Tom Herzog. I'm with the Redline Project. I'm heading up the noise and vibration study for this uh, final environmental impact statement and also the preliminary engineering. We are basically conducting, uh, exist documenting what the existing noise and vibration conditions are along the proposed Redline corridor. And that involves taking background noise measurements for over, let's say, a 24 hour period. We've selected uh, about 40 different locations that are representative of the corridor itself. For vibration, we use an accelerometer, which is a type of instrument that's mounted actually to a steel block that's coupled to the ground and is capable of, of measuring uh, the vibration, converts it to a voltage, and we use that number to develop what the impact right there would be. And, and that information then gets used as part of the Federal Transportation Administration's uh, guidelines to develop what the impact criteria would be for the future red line. And we use those criteria then to assess what the potential impact would be from the future red line and if we do have exceedances of, of the impacts then we would then investigate mitigation measures to kind of bring those levels below the, the criteria.